please select HD to be able to view the details on the photos. If you broke the neck strap hole on your Blade 350 QX3, this video may help you out with a solution. It happened to me and I just kind of wanted to get my helicopter back up and running. You can see where the broken eye strap sits, it's right above the power switch. Make sure you find yourself a clean area to do your work. Here is a close up of the broken eye strap. It happened to me by picking up the remote and putting it against my chest with a little bit of force. You will need a few supplies to get the project done. Some you may have laying around, some you may have to get from your local hardware store. You will need a small square um, rubber piece, like you saw in the picture before, a one inch by five millimeter stainless steel hex head bolt, and a rubber foot from an old piece of gear, like a CD player, a tape deck, or anything rubber. Uh, the dimensions are clearly uh, shown in the photos. Um, that should make things a lot easier for you. At this point, you will need a 3 16th of an inch drill bit to drill a hole where you remove the stickers. And uh, you will also need to drill the same size hole in the small square um, rubber piece as well as the rubber foot. Once you do that, you put them together as shown in the photos from the inside, being careful with the antenna wire and other electronics, and you secure it to the original bracket by tightening it up with an Allen wrench. Close back up the remote, putting back together all the screws carefully, and here is the final result. You have to flip around the actual phone um, clip part so that it works for you. I also added a cheap uh, $5 countdown timer to make sure I don't run out of juice while in flight and um, hope you enjoy it. It's working very well for me. Please understand that this is a permanent solution and the bracket will stay on the remote at all times. And as always, thanks for watching.